It said the Dorothy Collins would have loved it. A Day of the Dead ofrenda honoring the respected educator in the Edgewood School District. She helped desegregate what had been the Joskies department store downtown. Jesse Degollado tells us why the ofrenda for Dorothy Price Collins has added significance. A traditional Mexican ofrenda was being adorned by history students at St. Mary's University outside the San Antonio African American Community Archive and Museum. This represents both my cultures. I am African American. I'm also Hispanic American. A symbolic coming together of two cultures embraced by Dorothy Price Collins. And she would be very proud of that because she believed in helping everyone. Color didn't matter to her. As in most ofrendas, each item represents something about the person it honors. Among them, a photo of Collins and her former first grade student at Winston Elementary, the now legendary Gloria Stefan. Back then, Collins was asked why put so much effort helping an immigrant child who didn't speak English. And she said, because this is a child that is working hard to get to a different place than where she's been. The ofrenda also is a tribute to a woman who had stood up to segregation. Protest activities or uh, sit-in activities that, you know, that actually tried to move the needle. And now the ofrenda to Dorothy Price Collins has come to embody her lifelong belief in unity. We are more alike than different. Love you and remember you. Jesse oh. Degollado, KSAT 12 News. We are now just a little over a week away from Huertos Fest. This free event begins on October 29th at Hemisphere Park. There will be original artwork there, live music, dancing, and the largest open altar exhibition in San Antonio. Now, if you want to stay home but still enjoy the event, you can catch our primetime special, which will air Sunday, October 3rd from 8 to 10 p.m. on KSAT 12, KSAT.com, and KSAT Plus. You can learn more about Buentos Fest. Just scan this QR code that you see here on your screen.